Alright guys, welcome back to some more Pixamon! Yes. I'm in Ultra Space, I've done a slight boost to Rotom spawn rate because we weren't seeing Rotom at all, so hopefully that will show up, and hopefully I'll get my last three Ultra Beasts today? But I see all this oh, Rampardos yeah. and I'm like, I've gotta go catch that Rampardos because... Rampardos. Also, Nitz isn't here because he's having computer issues. Yep. Also, fun fact, um, Rampardos can learn Endeavor. <laughs> yes, it can. And Rampardos, this one at least, has a shitty enough defense stat that I was able to bring it down to the 1 HP. With oh, pulse swipe. Nice. So, uh, yeah. No, you're also at 1 HP. Uh, I guess I can go... Oh, wait, it's Sunrise. Shoot. Uh... Afternoon, of course it is. Oh yeah, I was I was looking for the uh, Dermanitan line as well while I was out here. So that's a thing. Night. I hate this. It is early daytime in uh, Ooh, Ultra Space. Sunrise. Yeah, it's sunrise in the Overworld too. All right, Woo Bat, I need you. Come back. No. Yes, Quick Ball. Also, was there something that only spawned in Mesa Plateau F or something, or did I fix that? Uh, you fixed that. That was Scrafty. Oh, well, because my uh, <laughs> Mesa over here spawns Scrafty and also has a Mesa Plateau F in the center. Nice. In Ultra Space, so. Oh, Guzzler. Oh, sweet. So Guzzler is here? Mesas, yeah. Oh, all Mesas, yeah. Well, so I am very much good for Arceus. I have at least three of every plate. Oh, nice. So someday I'll get that. What does Guzzler spawn on? Um, just ground. Ricotta. Yeah, uh, Alright, who left a PC? Danny. In my Danny. Danny. In Danny. my teleport room. Danny. Danny. It's definitely Danny. 100% Danny. <laughs> I will have to have a talk with him. We tried. He, 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 he won't just you know, say the I'm same just, thing. You know what? You know what? You know what? I'm going to go to his biome, and I'm going to leave a teleporter right outside his door. <laughs> Oh, hey, a wild Flareon. Do I have a Flareon? See, I'm pretty sure I do. Easy way, easy way to fix this problem. Just fill hit every block in this house, uh, house with PCs. Here we go. I have, I have, I have returned his PC. It is on the steps leading That's up to the That's what we should do. <laughs> we should return every PC that he ever places and just yeah. place them in his home. Now he gets them back, you know? Yep. Or I could just drop, you know, $100,000 of uh, poke money on buying a bunch of PCs to just fill his house anyway. That works. <laughs> Go for it. That's 100 PCs. That Rem 100%. Remind me on that, because uh, I have to get this Ultra Space hunt first, and I'm going to forget by the end of the episode. 100%. Where are you, Dwebble? You're one of the very few daytime spawns I actually need. I can't wait to get the Pokedex done so I can do the Living Dex part. See, I, the, the way I figure it is I'm going to be stuck on the Legendary side of things, so they're both, both going to finish at the same time for me. I mean, I definitely have a big pile of Legendaries done, so yeah. See, Ghost, before you can actually work on your Living Dex, I haven't even found Lake Spirits yet. Oh, God, that yeah, true. that too. I'm, I have to do that again And soon. deleting large amounts of uh, breeding failures. Yeah, sort your PC. <laughs> it's about to be afternoon. I'm going to go to a Desert Hills for a Darumaka. I finally Ball sorted Ball. my uh, PC on Pokemon Go and I opened up 200 slots because I had extras and junk oh. and random crap. So. And by sort, he means he held down his push on many Pokemon he doesn't need and really mass released them all. No, I I literally scanned. This was before the IV checkers um, updated the uh, appraisal system thing. So I mm -hmm. manually went through with the uh, IV Poke Genie app and 
checked every stat on everything. That app doesn't really have much purpose anymore, huh? Um, I would love it if the app updated and then gave me the ability to put those little numbers in the circle thing, because those are way more convenient. Plus, it still is kind of needed, because it's not the exact numbers still. Well, it's not exact numbers, but if it's like almost full, you can tell it's a 14. If it's, a, if it's full, it's a 15. The 15s are all that really matters. Yeah, I love the searching by like four and then the little asterisk star thing. Mm -hmm. Be able to see all my perfects. Apparently, I picked up a level 34 perfect anorith when I was in the park the other week and did oh. not know it. Yeah, I have zero hundred percents. Yeah, and it's going to be amazing because I can use that as a bug attacker with stab that can uh, kill Mewtwo's and stuff. Yeah, my Armaldo has Struggle Bug and Water Pulse. Yeah, I think it, I think the best one you can get is Bug Rock for the move combo. I don't think yeah. it's Bug Bug, but it's they the Armaldos can go to like twenty six hundred ish around level thirty five. So they have a lot of attack. Yeah. Yeah, they're one of the few bugs that's other than like Pinsir that's any good. Damn. Yeah, Mega. Now, none of the Ultra Beasts have a time of day. There's just the one that requires clear weather. Okay. I still need to look for a sunflower for or a flower forest. Bro. All right. Well, there is a birch forest hills north of this mesa, so I'm going to give up on uh, Guzzlord for a little bit, head over there, then come back, keep looking for that hidden ability Duramaka. Actually, that's afternoon. Why don't I see them right now? Oh, no, that's desert hills. Yeah, it's. I'm about to look for that as well. Well, it's too late. Shit. It's about to become nighttime, and so those aren't going to be around. All right. So I was thinking they were in Mesa, so I was just hanging around Mesa, thinking I could kill all the birds with one stone, but no. No. Birds live today. Some of the Some birds are animals? part. Is there? Yeah, there is a grass flying type. Tropius. Tropius. Yeah. Shaman. I was going to say that some of the birds are resistant to the rock, but I mean, they'd still be 1x. Grass? Does, wait, does grass resist rock? I don't think it does. I, I think grass think is it... weak to rock. No. Oh. No, rock is oh, definitely weak, weak to grass because Bulbasaur had 4x effectiveness against Brock's well, gym. Yeah, duh. That doesn't mean it resists. I th think grass does. It resists rock, but not ground. If I remember. Slash check type, type Tropius. Weak to rock. Oh. What a so command. It doesn't resist. Tarraga. Oh, I think I'm thinking of, uh... Damn it. I think I'm confusing Temtem and Pixel or Pokemon again. Like, I can believe learning that. an entirely different system where their things are sort of synonymous, but nature isn't exactly quite grass is, uh... Yeah, it messes with your brain. Nature probably bug and grass combined. Yeah. Please and then, like, water, water is weak to toxin. That's fair, actually. That, makes, that sort of makes sense. Yeah. Like, it's kind of a crazy thing. And then your rival gets a bullshit data type, which is essentially the dragon god of the uh, typing list. Nice. Is there no, like, hard counter fairy it, type? There is nothing that's, I think, like, super hard counter to it. Everything is neutral or weak to it. Uh, okay. And I, I think I think electricity might do damage to it a little bit better or something, but, like, it's very, very ridiculously overpowered. Yeah. Basically, that whole fight where you're like, yeah, I'm gonna sit there with my Squirtle and I'm gonna tackle its his uh, Charmander or his uh, Bulbasaur, and it's gonna tackle me back, and it's a pointless fight. Is I'm just gonna one shot you and then laugh in your face, and you're like, well, fuck you too, rival. <laughs> nice. At least I think that's what should happen. I didn't know what all the buttons on the UI did, so I ended up having my. Uh, Starter do a like wait and regain energy turn, and then you got one shot. Right. But I got one shot, and so I'm assuming it would have happened either way. Yeah. All right, Avara. 
Okay, where are the whirlipedes? Here, circuitry, circuitry, wiki, circuitry, <laughs> biome, birch forest, birch forest, M. Yeah, it's the right thing. I mean, like you said, someone completed on the fan servers so at 100 percent spawns. Yeah. Just whether some of these spawn frequently enough or not. That means they got that. Including the Reggies and stuff before you made them spawn on the surface. No. I, I Whenever I made the changes to our server, I transferred them to the fan server. So I think the Reggies, some of the Reggies might have happened afterwards. Oh. But I think they did catch some Reggies before it. Yeah. Also, verification, Reggies will spawn in uh, man-made uh, spawn pits. Yeah, I know. I've said that before. It's just, uh, like, less easy to get them to spawn for whatever reason. Yeah. It's just they're a really rough condition. Like, you have to make sure the ceiling's high enough, but not too high, because otherwise it doesn't count as a cave. And Yeah. yeah. And there's no, like, guide that tells you what is and isn't a cave. Yeah. Because I don't think we honestly knew when we were programming it. We just had a, like, there's a set of conditions with, like, ceilings and not being able to see the sky checks and stuff like that and it's very complicated yeah and i think it was one of those things where it's like if this condition is true or this condition and so it wasn't like you could just you know find one specific example like a lot of things may or may not qualify mm-hmm um, do I have a pawn yard yet? I'm pretty sure I do. I remember catching one in the end. Yeah, I do. Where are you, Whirlipede? I've seen a million before. I've never caught one. They're afternoon and nighttime spawns. Yes. Oh, I gotta resist the urge to catch Murkrow. I've been trying to get a good haunch crow on go, so I'm like, <gasps> Murkrow. <gasps> I have a semi-decent haunch crow. I just, like, need better moves on it. I got mine, but it's only got dark flying, and I kind of want it to be dark dark, but people say that it's not the best attacking move set. And It's the best flying attacker. Yeah, the thing is, like, flying is only good against, like, fighting. And grass and bug. Yeah, but grass and bug are never in gyms that you can't counter with either fire or, hey, uh, whenever Verizion comes out, when Gen 5 drops, tell me you won't see Hauntras everywhere. Yeah. My issue is I just do not have any anti-psychic. Like, it is so hard to get good bug or dark types. I got a pincer nest. Yeah, you got lucky. Like, that pincer nest would be amazing. I currently have a uh, Electivire nest, so... That's very good. I got a that very good Electivire for uh, Suicune Day. So now I have some good Raikus and a good Electivire. See, I've learned that I actually have like no need to participate in the raid. Like, I just kind of, I'll win regardless, because 20 people is absurd. Oh yeah, with 20 people, you do not have to do anything with the raids. Yeah, and honestly, it doesn't change how much you get for the most part. Mm-hmm. Um, if you're low manning raids, then your participation matters because you actually have a shot at the damage balls. But if you don't have a good counter set to it, then just, you know, leech. I assume you also get, like, 20-person raids on the, like, uh, like, raid community day things. Oh, god, yes. Yeah. Like, I, the most recent time when we met the, uh, the grandmother and her grandkids and stuff going out to do it, mm -hmm. they were, uh... We started on a the, the off side of the park because I wanted to experiment with starting not in the most common spot in the park and then heading towards the entranceway. And so we had the group of seven with the grandma and the kids, but then we ran into everybody else and there was like a massive wave of people. Nice. And then like even when we found ones that weren't that common, we just waited for like five minutes and like two carloads of people would pull up or like a carload at the very end of the day. Um, pulled up, and each person of the four people in the car had two phones, so that qualified us on that one. 
Yeah, I, they, I've seen a lot of people with two phones, like multiple phones and stuff. Like that. Yeah, because people can't make it because they're working, so they're like, here, take my phone. Mm -hmm. That is the one thing about these days. Like, I liked how they did the Eevee one back, uh, like, last year, because they did it as a community weekend, because it's Eevee. Yeah, because you needed 10,000 shiny ones, so you can get a shiny at yeah. every evolution. And uh, I'm so sad that that's already gone by, because I would have been, like, camped out in the park 24-7 kind of a thing. Mm -hmm. I just think that, like, having just a like, three-hour period is really lame, because some people just can't do it. Like, they do weekends to make it as available as possible, but at the same time, they're doing Sunday. Like, Sunday is not available for many people. Yeah, it's late in the afternoon. Like, very few religious observances last that long. So, I mean, but, like, so yeah, some people work on Sundays and stuff. And... Yeah. Like, they made it, like, an hour later than it used to be. It used to be, like, not even, uh, local time. It used to just be straight up, uh, that time. It was the same time for everyone in the Americas or any everyone in Europe. Mm-hmm. That, that was, was crazy. awful. That was, yeah, that was awful. Oh, yeah, because some Sky. places is going to be, like, 2 a.m. It started at, like, noon for Sky, I'm pretty sure it used to. Yeah, I was always asleep when it happened, so that's why I was always, like, never interested in playing Pokemon Go that often. Mm. But now there's Mudkip Day, so you're going to leave the house. Absolutely. I, I have incense ready and everything. Yeah, I have in enough, the, oh, nice. enough incense to get extra. Holy shit, there's Flygons just flying by. It's like a whole You have a lure? Board. I do. Like, I want a shiny, a good shiny, uh, uh... I mean, if you go to a populated park, you're gonna find a bunch. Yeah. I have a really big park right near me that is really good for stuff like this. Probably go mm -hmm. there. It's gonna be really hot, though. Yeah, as suck. expected. For me, I have, like, a 50% chance of rain, so I'm just very much so hoping it doesn't do that. I would cry. Now, is full sun the one that boosts ground, or is it cloudy that boosts ground? Clear. Clear boosts, uh... Okay, so yeah, I'm definitely 100% gonna have level 35, uh... Ghost to potential. water type. It's... Is it water ground, or is that later? It's pure water. Ah! Water. Then I wish it was cloudy, because I'm not gonna go out in that damn heat. Or I don't want to go out in that damn heat. <laughs> yep. Oh, that's really sad. I was... I was thinking it was water ground the whole way through the line. No, pure water at Mudkip. Alright, well, that's level 30 max for me, then. Oh, well, there goes Rotom's spawn window. I hate this stupid Pokemon. Bumped it up to 50. Yeah, that's great. That doesn't make the spawn window longer than 30 seconds. True, true. It's so hard to get a spawn that you want within 30 like, like what it was before was I wish I could manually starter. Yeah, I, I, I wish I could manually expand that window to make it like an extra hour on both sides. Yeah, you can replace the mid with nothing. Yeah, if I just change it to full night, but then it like I don't know. We only need one of them, so good for you. You only needs one of them. Do you understand how good of a Pokemon Rotom is? Yeah, that's true. Oh, but no, no, the thing is, after I catch one, you can't change it, because then I'll be mad. Mm. You can't change it. So I need to change it before one. you catch one. You certainly better, because okay, look, I'll be like, uh, Wait, what? I'm going to kill it for a beast ball. Oh, Fairmouse is dope. Wait, check the essence it gives. Does it give, like, a ton? Uh, no, because it the, the Ultra Beast were added in after the mod would stop oh, being right. updated. Uh, what typing does it get? Bug fighting? Um, well, I now have 5k. Okay, I think it gave me 5k. Oh. Of oh, what? I don't know why I would have 5k bug and 5k fighting otherwise. And I think I just saw kill... the number changed when I clicked on it. Did you kill a Verizion? Nope. So I'm thinking the Ultra Beast might have been included in that le most recent patch. That's really weird. Maybe top is just. Or maybe they give maybe just they... enough because Actually, it was a 66. I bet, you... that I bet all the, like, the new. I bet all the new legendaries work. I think it's just the top have the space in their name, so it probably breaks it. 
Mmm, yeah, because in the wiki command it has to be without the space. I'll let you know next yeah. time I uh, see an Ultra Beast I don't care about killing. I got a GS ball from it. Oh, I got my perfect Pokemon. I have to hatch it. Where are you, Whirlipede? I've never had a problem finding a Whirlipede before. I have a Trap Inch, right? Yeah, good. Oh, I love Psyduck in his new model and his little dance of headacheness. Dance of headacheness. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's still way early in the day. Purloin of all the 20. All right. So at 10, I need to head over and look for Duramaka. Or Dermanitan, or... What, what, how are they pronounced? Sorry. Darumaka. Darumaka. Hello? Oh, wait, Royal Pete, yes. But yeah, I love the new search feature, being able to just go five or four with the uh, little asterisk star thing and find all your yeah. perfect IV ones. And I think it's meant to be like one star, two star, three star. Yeah, star. so there's zero star, one star, two star, three star, and four star for perfect. So it's basically yeah. the old is not going to make progress, is above average, caught my attention, and is a wonder from the appraisals. But now they're universalized mm -hmm. across all of the different teams, so that way you don't have to keep track of what your team's phrase is. Yeah. I'm probably going to regret this. Let's see if I can... No, oh, okay, I'll just kill him a tang. All right. I was going to try to paralyze it, but apparently my Pangoro is so strong that even though it's metal type, I can still body slam through it. Yup. I only had, like, 50 levels on it, so... Yeah, only 50. Only twice its level. Let's see, what other shenanigans? Oh, I got my Celebi today on uh, Go. All right. I'm nowhere near any of those. I can't wait to do them, though. I, I, I would love a Celebi and a Mew. I yeah, can't wait for the Jirachi. One oh, of the, the Jirachi uh... one? The, the, the Jirachi one actually leaked. It seems really easy. What is it? Oh, what the heck did I do that for? Uh, like, one of the tasks is catch a Whismur and evolve a Whismur. That only Whismur works because so things are common. I'm still stuck in that Slugma Gulpin one. I have not seen a Slugma or a Gulpin ever. I have both that spawn uh, around me. They spawn around me at night, so that wait, might be your problem. Is the Jirachi one live? No, I didn't see it. Why, what are you doing a Slugma and a Gulpin for? That's for, uh... The uh, Meltan. Oh, I was gonna say Gulpin Shen three. There's no way you like. Bleh. But yeah, it makes sense. Yeah, it was things that can digest like toxins and metals and stuff. I've seen a couple of Gulpins, and I see a uh, Slugma when it's a clear weather. That's it, though. Okay, because yeah, like I don't see those around our our locations, so. I know that some of them come from one of the three types of lures, so I'm kind of tempted to, on the route I'm going to walk for Community Day, grab one of the special lures and drop it down, because then it'd be a three-hour special lure. Uh, oh, wait, what? Uh, be careful, though, because those weighted towards certain Pokemon, they wouldn't spawn Mudkip. Right. So I would put it on, like, an end, and it would pull in maybe some of the, uh, like, the Gulpins and stuff. I think I need the... Water one for the gulpin or something? None of them do gulpin. I think it's the grass one. I guess the grass would make sense because grass poison. Yeah, the grass one brings in gulpin. Although I would kind of want to do the metal one because that's the one I need for the evolutions. But I don't have enough candy for uh, nose pass or magnemite. My experience with the magnetic lure has been really good. I got a shiny onyx from one of those. Apparently, onyx has a increased shiny rate compared to other like most Pokemon. That's cool. Like, apparently, like, Shiny Ray is determined by the Pokemon, not as just a Speaking big Speaking of, concept. Onyx appears in front of me, but is not Shiny. Trash. 
Oh, the Steelix is really weird in Pixel Monzo. Not the worst. Stay in the Pokeball and present. Alright, now I just need to find a hidden ability Duramanka. What Pokemon special? On pheasant. Oh, on pheasant. There you Unfazant. go. On pheasant. Most people probably aren't gonna get the joke anymore. Nope. That's, that's how <laughs> ghost. Honest to God, thought on pheasant was pronounced. Yeah, I thought it was like it was like uh, the the French. Uh... Wait, was which game was it in? Uh, the American one. It was fifth gen. Hmm. That was uh, the America-based one by shown by the uh, the dessert Pokemon in the garbage. Hmm. <laughs> Just saying, like yeah, fair it's enough. there. Kind of nutshell. Surprised it wasn't a gun Pokemon. Literally. Ah, uh, no, there was. Never mind. So I was gonna say uh. Remoraid. Okay, yeah, Remoraid, but that's Gen two. <laughs> And there's Clauncher, but that's uh, Gen 5, 6. Surprisingly, the only gun Pokemon we've had was Gen 2. Mm hmm. And the Beak. <laughs> Which oh, one was yeah. Gen 2's one? Uh, Remoraid. Hmm. It literally looks like a gun if you, like, especially if you look at, like, early concept art. Yeah, it, it was meant to be a gun, it evolved into a tank. That's why that's why its evolution makes zero sense now. Okay, I was wondering why a random fish evolved into an octopus because I'm like that does not make sense evolutionarily. Yeah. I have a full Corona. I have at least a Larvesta. Okay. All right, this thing is done for my tournament team. Well, bread anyway. Okay, so I am in. Oh, I'm in desert, not desert hills over here. All right. Let's go, dude. We're good. I guess I'll bring that now. That just needs to work on catching stuff again. It's afternoon now. Where are my Stoutland? And it's sunset. Crap. I thought I was in desert hills the whole time, but it tended, it just turned out it was just a hilly desert. Well, it just hit afternoon uh, in the overworld. Yeah, I... I'm gonna go back to the, the the forest for Zerkatry, and then I'm gonna call my adventure in Ultra Space because I need to go in the overworld and get some stuff caught. Yeah, and actually see a sky again. Yeah, that would be nice. Rather than just constantly changing colors. I mean, your unlucky guy's actually in this episode. Yeah, it's crazy. I knew it was coming. <laughs> I'm so upset. <laughs> hey, I'm glad I didn't give up. There is a Guzzlord. You knew That's it was coming, and yet you allowed me to walk right into that one. You Sky, you could have that... you like said something. Like... You could have stopped. It. I'm too yeah. busy drawing. Okay. I'm, I'm coloring or well, coloring. I'm coloring a picture. While waiting what for are you nighttime so you can get your of? healing yeah. ability. While I'm waiting for nighttime. Guzzlord is a monstrous tank. Also, I love it its design. Very demonic. It only has HP for stats. That's the only stat they gave it. The rest are wow. nothing. I think it has a base of 200 HP or something like that. Wiki, Guzzlord, base stats. Yeah, uh, 223 HP, 101 attack, and it's got a good attack and special attack, but yeah, the defenses and speed yeah. are terrible. It's like Dri It's literally built like Drifloom, and that's not good. I don't want to evolve a Lillipup into a... Ah. Well, it's my hurt here. It's supposed to be yellow, right? Hmm? Like black, no. yellow, and blue? Yes. Okay. The shiny is, by God, the most noticeable shiny ever. Well, it's the first time I've seen one of them, so I just wanted to make sure. You should shiny token that. I mean, I might. It's a decent-sized one. I like its design. You know it's like a very like? much a, like a demonic thing. What's the shiny? It's a pumpkin. No, 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 no. Token it before you, uh, token it right now. If you're not going to token anything else, do it. Well, I'll token it later. But if, no, it, is, it, right if it is Halloween-themed, it'll go to the, uh, Halloween area. 
Ominous woods. No, 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 no. I don't want no. to just burn random tokens. Wait, wait. Where did you get the idea of Halloween themed? Because this guy said pumpkin. Pumpkin? It's more like... It really likes pizza. Oh, oh, you were trying to make me waste my token. This no, is why it's you don't a phenomenal fall... shiny. All no. the black turns solid white, and it, all the, everything else turns orange. It looks like it, it's like solid white, and it eats pizza. It's like it's like a moldy pumpkin. Like imagine, uh, okay, except for it's mostly mold instead of only yeah. partially moldy. Exactly. Come on, Stoutland. All right. Well, then I'll just have to wait till one of someone finds the flower forest in uh, Ultra Space. You don't know where a sunflower plains is, you'll find one. Didn't we have that one little strip somewhere, somewhere? Mitz gave you a thing for it, I think. Where are you, Stoutland? I want a Stoutland. I've seen a couple in the past. Like, where are they now? Isn't that third form? Yeah. I'd also like a herdier or something that's high enough level to evolve. That'd be great. I was too. gonna say you're more likely to find one stage down max level. I'm just not finding it. I'm only seeing like a couple little pups. Well, they're, they'll spawn eventually if you've got the little pups. There's just so many things that spawn in that biome. I remember not seeing very many of them. Oh, nicely done, Don. Jolly Pikachu. That's actually a good nature for it too. No, isn't it? <laughs> no. It was the one that I had. <laughs> Oh, because Jolly's speed up, special attack down. Uh, I yeah. was confusing it with Timid. Yeah, Timid's really good. Well, it's, I mean, it's good for a low-end Raichu. Normal Raichu, uh... It's normal Raichu. It literally only gets, like, Thunderbolt. And, like, I guess it's Focus Blast. I think it gets Focus Blast. Oh, yeah, and I uh, got a low-end Raichu today, so I was happy about that. Did you solo it? Yep. A... With Browdon and a uh, Sunny Weather, and also uh, Torteros with Bite and Earthquake. Yeah, it goes down not too bad. Yeah, I could believe that. It was still like like 15, 20 seconds left, because most solo runs do take about that long, but... I can't wait to actually uh, get a Torterra. I'm like so close. I'm like 80 candies and I have a Grotto. They're pretty solid if you get the right movesets on them, because they tank so well. Anything electric just cannot handle them, because they're quad resist. The starters I'm getting uh, closest to getting Max Evolved are a Sceptile and a uh, Charizard. Okay, Charizard's different. I, I don't see Charmander, but uh, Trico, I for some reason see more than any other starter. Same. Yeah, they're, they're a fairly common one. Turtwig was the super common one in my area, but like Trico is the second closest. Oh, I also have a Combustion, but I rarely see that, unless it's in, like, one specific spot. Ooh, yeah, that, I've seen a few Torchic a day, but, like, they are not crazy. I had, like, two or three Mudkips as well. But I almost feel bad wasting time catching Mudkips, knowing they're going to be everywhere. Well, you might as and well then, get them. I mean, I'm still grabbing them because they're more likely to have better IVs now. Those are more candy. A few days after, we get the the One Piece event. Oh yeah, the literal day after. Yeah. Goes from Mudcap event to uh, One Piece Pikachu. So how do the Hat Pikachu events work? Because I haven't been through one. They yet. spawn. So they'll just be wild everywhere. Yeah, like you know. Well, they'll be like Rattata and Diglett. No, I was gonna say, like, you know how, uh... Well, I guess no, that works. You know how the Alolan event was, where like, it was a bunch of Alolan Pokemon? Mm, they're just like, only that gonna be Pikachu. Pikachu. Not, no, not that many, because there's less species, but, like... Oh, okay. I was gonna say, because I'm like, how many Pikachu candies do you really need after a certain point? The Pikachus are just for collection. They're pretty mad. No one, honestly, cares too much for them anymore. Like, there's collector things, but at this point, they're also just box space being filled up. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, I have a whole bunch of those party hat Pikachu's, but some of them are like level eight. <laughs> yeah. And so I'm like, 
kind of want to junk them, but they also are never available. Well, I mean, those ones are available again, but... All of them come back eventually, except for, like, the, like, Ingress one and I the... I doubt the One Piece one will either, because it's yeah, celebrating no, I... a 20th anniversary. That's... They'd have to have, like... They'd have to buy, like, a super license for that or something like that. Like, the licensing on that would not be, like, great. So maybe well, we'll get shiny directly... ones. The shiny ones are already in. The shiny straw hat one. Yeah, I know. So they always release the shiny with the uh, hats. But it's uh, not an easy jam. It's like, I'm assuming it's Oh, yeah, you, you get chance. to get one. Yeah. It's, uh, that's, like, the goal. Like, that and, like, like, oh, dude, I would love a shiny straw hat Pichu. It's, like, ultra rare. Yeah, I think there's probably not a very large number of those in existence, potentially, for any of the events. There's zero. Because the event's not out yet. Well, I know, but I mean for, like, the older events. I remember seeing one post on a Reddit thread where someone had a shiny one with a hat for one of the old ones. But what hat was it? It, either the, it was either the sun hat or the uh, flower crown one. Oh, the flower crown one is... Uh, maybe that was a spring event. I'm so mad I missed that. The Eevee Lucians are so sick. I would have loved... Like, well, I mean, I would have had like my entire box just filled with Eevee. I have the hardest time deleting Eevees from my box, let me tell you. <laughs> I delete like all the trash ones, like they're like 10 CP, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, like if if they're at least moderate, or if they have a perfect attack set, I'm like, well, you could just become an Espeon for the army. That's literally what I've been doing. I literally just like grind them up in Espeon because there's no reason not to. Yeah, well, I, I want to grind up a few to get another uh, an actual really good Glaceon that's above 30 because my current Glaceons are like 22 and 25. I think my list is like 32 because I didn't realize I was past 30 and I kept powering it up, so. Yeah, apparently I was a dumb and didn't check the last time I upgraded my, uh, uh, the, what was it called? The Raikou. And so I had, it was reading from the naming system I had on it, level 28. So I'm like, okay, I'll put in enough candies to go up four level ups to bring it to 30 and then I'm done with it. Well, it's 32 now, because, uh, okay. it... What? You gotta write him. Nice. Yes! Is there a dark forest... Roof forest? There is a roof forest right Continue over here. Continue your sentence. But, uh... Yeah, so um, I have a now a level 32 Raikou, because I didn't update its nameplate label. I mean, it's stronger regardless. Yeah, and I mean, it's Raikou, like, electric is worth you know, a lot in general. I'd have been more upset had I done it with the Entei. It's like, my Entei... Yeah. Like, Entei was useful. I had to fight a really, really strong, like, 3,400 CP Executor in the gym today. So I was like, well, oh, Raikou, right. or uh, Entei has this, because it's a fire, fire Entei. Mm -hmm. Was it an actual Executor? Yeah. So, like, not the Alolan one? Yeah, the one that's actually weak to fire. Yeah, the one I was going to say, because like, I don't have a fire for the dragon one. It's neutral. Yeah, I know. Yeah. But, uh, do, uh, do you know what the Ingress thing is? Like, what is Ingress? It is the original game. I don't know what the hell the game was, but it was their, it's what they have all of the data for the Pokestops and stuff based off of. Because like, I've seen people in the Discord I'm in like say that they're level 40 on Ingress so they can submit Pokestops. Yeah, so the way it works is any... Like, they share a database of locations. So if the Ingress game or app or whatever gets a location added to it, a stop appears in Go. Okay. And apparently it's easier to hit level 40 on that than there's easier to hit level 40 on go, so you get the access to the suggest a stop faster. Ah, uh, okay. That it's not sense. too bad. That's 14 and above across all stats. It's actually pretty decent, yeah. Alright, this is cool. But yeah, I, I like the idea that there's like a real world mapping thing, because it kind of reminds me of Log Horizon. I would love an MMO where it's like just the real world in like almost the same scale. 
where the game world is just too big to travel. Like, that'd be so cool. Mm-hmm. They'd never do it, but it'd be cool. Okay, there we go. Okay. Is this <laughs> done? I'm trying to torture myself. <gasps> Sorry. Up, up, and away! Okay, um... I have Helioptile, because I used it in a tournament. Have I brought and trap in chance? Like I, I feel really bad. Like I'm not catching a lot of stuff right now because I'm looking for the rare spawns in these biomes, just to fill up the last little bits of the decks. Oh, that's All right, fish. Lele, that's the common one. Have we ever found a Feeny or a? Uh, no, no one has a Feeny yet. It was. It was almost got Coco. I mean, Sunrise now. Ah, it was just timing based, yeah. It's like mid morning in Ultra Space. I was like, what? Where is it? <gasps> this is it. This is the Holy Land. Oh. oh. Coco is not on. Are there holes in it? <laughs> no, it is an entire gigantic shelf of just sand blocks hanging out over a, a cliff area. Put a torch on it. Whoosh. It's more fun. Oh, shit, that... Oh, that was bad. <laughs> that was bad. Okay, so it was like a C-shaped overhang on the edge of one of the Ultra Space platforms. So mm -hmm. I punched a block because I always like doing the punching breaking because it's more personal than putting a torch on it. Um, but I, so I punched a block on the upper overhang and so like this entire massive shelf came down and then the pieces hit the ground below me and apparently I was standing on another sand overhang so I almost oh. plummeted off from chain <laughs> reaction. Nice. It was, nice. that was good. I, I, that, I like that. I don't know why that gives me so much pleasure in Minecraft, but just watching sand fall like that is just, it's so wonderful. It's great. It's probably because it's kind of an interesting mechanic. And you just never see that mechanic because you're no yeah. one's stupid enough to dig into sand. Ghost, you know what you can do to appease that, uh, that want for that? Hmm. Is make a giant uh, either sand or gravel tower, break the bottom block and put a torch under it. Oh yeah, I've done that before. You usually do like two blocks, that way you can have like a solid stone block or something. Like you yeah. do two stone blocks, take out the bottom stone block, put the torch there, and then take out the, tor the top one and then the whole sand pile falls. Dude. I want a Rotom in Pokemon Go. How are they gonna do that? Whoa. Is Rotom in Pokemon Go? No. It could be a field research, like uh Oh I guess Celebi. Oh, you're I guess right. Gen is... Or it could be like Spinda and be a huge pain in the ass. Well, the thing is they have to release them all separately because they don't do like you can't change forms of Pokemon. They might add an item or something. Yeah, I'm still trying to collect my uh entire set of the cast forms. Oh, well, yeah. I actually think I have them all. I have them all. I got one during a hurricane. I got one when it was pouring rain and the other one I got because sunny form and normal form are easy. Yeah, they, it, one The one time we've had rain all summer, <laughs> it refused to spawn cast forms near me. There's 10 million sunny ones and they're useless. Well, the thing is, like, the sunny ones... Well, actually... Theoretically, they should all be more common because they're all weather boosted. Yeah. Hmm. It's just I only see the sun one, but most of the weather has been sun or cloudy. I that's weird. Whoa. Welcome to weather in Utah summer. Apparently. Hey, ghost. Wait, half of this is Desert M. Crap. Ghost, do you happen to have a uh, hidden ability? Uh, member of the Tepig line? 
Uh, I do not think so, but let me... What is the uh, Tepic Line's hidden ability? Reckless. It's not Blaze. That's all you need to know. Yeah. I have a thick, fat Tepic. No, you don't. It's definitely not a Tepic. Thick, fat would be wild on a Tepic, but... Definitely not. I mean, I literally up. have Tepig thick, fat. Boost resistance to fire and ice type. Oh, Tepig's hidden ability is thick fat, yeah. Oh. So I do have a hidden ability in the Tepig line. Yeah, you want M. How are its stats? If I show it. Yeah. Would you like to trade? Good God. That zero HP is unfortunate, but would Sky, you like to trade? Sky, you might just want to breathe like a couple times for the HP. Maybe. Because you don't forget, Reckless involves you losing HP. Yeah. Huh. Well, I'm glad I had a hidden ability one. I didn't even that know it was worth something. That is ungodly. Jesus. That is pretty wild. Like, the IVs are insane. Damn. Ooh, my, the Embor I have is 64. Oh, it's also uh, a bad nature. So if you're going to breed, make sure it's a bad nature. But yeah, the one I have right now is uh, Adamant, and it, it has 24 HP. So what is the uh, uh, reckless? Mm -hmm. That's the uh, does more damage to itself recoil or something. Oh, it's both male. Uh, it does less damage to itself. You're gonna what? have to breathe with the ditto. It what? is male. Because you can't pass hidden ability from a male. I thought you could. It was just harder. No, with ditto. You can't. Yeah. With ditto only. If there is a female, the female's nature is always prioritized, and the male doesn't even come. Uh... Let's see if I have a HP tank to do, or one that's adamant. Cause remember, Crit really wanted that hidden ability female. Do you have an adamant uh, ditto, Smash? Uh, so what is uh pig knights? Uh, I think adamant was on the hunt when it, when I got all these. Oh. So I guess it has thick fat until it gets reckless. Huh. Didn't know that. Yeah. Well, there you go. You have two? Apparently, out of the four things I have, two of them are hidden ability. See, the second one, one is worse. Yeah, you'd want But it has the HP stat, so if you get a it female does. from breeding in your nature, you can breed with that one to get the 24 HP immediately. Yeah. Ghost, do you have an a adamant uh, ditto? I'm just gonna hope this is the paper. Um. I gotta have to free with fire and cake. Uh -huh. Nice. Actually, Sky, I already have one of those set up if you wanna use it. Sure. That's what I brought my baby Magmar with. Oh, there's no way to ignore Magma. name changes, is there? I named uh, a lot no. of my dittos that were Wait, actually good for something. Five billion IQ? There's a ditto right here, and I have an admin saying. Yeah? There you go. Yes, I have a half fire, half cake one. Okay. It's already here because I brought Magby with it. Dope. Is this the right I way? I almost made a yeah. mistake. I Did almost you? threw my teleporter at the ditto. Yeah, that would have been a mistake. I can't believe I had two hidden ability ones. That's cool. Okay, I have well, a false swiper. Right. I want mana today. How much time we got left? We have time. I can what's, get a mana. What's mana? Mana, redwood? it's the little. Yeah, it's in Redwood Biome. It's at night. Have you ever seen one? Uh, I'm. Uh, Rotoma's on ground in the forest, right? In the forest at midnight, yeah. Alright, so I'm in Ultra Space. So it is 1140 right now. 1435 from 15, 1525. It's a very limited window. And Ultra Space has the disadvantage of it's not easy to wipe spawns. Yeah. I think I should stand outside in this Extreme Hills M. And then run in when it becomes 1340? Huh? It, it starts at 1430. 
14 30 okay. then midnight starts so i'll run it around 14. all right uh well the dno are spawning now i just need a zwilus i want stoutland maybe i have a zwilus i don't know i don't know why i always check my spawn teleporter let's go do i have a skarmory I guess I won't know. You know I have a car bank. I don't have a car bank? Are you kidding me? Nope. I probably don't either. It got adamant. Does it have HP? Unfortunate. Does not have HP. I mean, it's better than zero. But you have to put the Everstone on it anyway, so... I have a naive. Uh, you know what? Screw you, Carby. I want out of here. Sky, you don't want Jolly? I mean, Jolly wouldn't be bad, but like. Like. Wait, let me check what item I was having on it. That poor trainer out there. They're sitting on a lone single block above the void. Jolly wouldn't be bad, but. Do you have a Charlie Ditto? No, it's just that like 65 is a really awkward speed because you like you want to be like faster. So, Ghost, do you have a Charlie Ditto? Um, I probably do. I tried syncing Dittos to the major four, and I think I've got two out of the three. Hmm. I think you had both speed majors. Yeah. No Stoutland or Herdier. None. Not at all. Man, this sucks. And Q1430. Come on, Rotom. Now, are they, like, noticeable in appearance or... They're orange. Great. Or the red whole world trying. is red and orange. Well, you picked a bad time, then. Come back later. Oh, wait. You can't, because it only spawns during midnight. Well... Whoa. Whoa. But the fact you got one in one episode of trying means they do spawn a lot better now. Oh, you, you, you better have included the word now, bud. I've been doing this literally all day. It's not worked until now. Come on, spawn quicker. Somebody's been here because there are books lying around. I think it might have been me. All right, well, there is the time window. Now to check Sky's for house. Any existing spawns? Everstone, right? uh, Everstone is the nature, Destiny not is IVs. Okay, so. And it's right. not just from the Pokemon it's on, it's from both Pokemon. Yeah, it yeah. picks five random stats and it can also pick HP from mom and HP from HP dad, from in which case it's random or red one. higher. What are you trying to get? Mana! Oh, yeah, they, they spawn somewhat often. Ah. Are you really on 5th gen for your first page of the decks? Uh, at, uh... Hey, first it's page is debatable. Oh. Like, yes, it's on my first page. My first page has Pig Knight, Duat, Samurai, Stalin, Mana, and Musharna. It's just, it also has a lot of legendaries. But in terms of non-legendaries, yes, I'm on 5th gen. Nice. And it's going to be the biggest pain because it's the biggest generation. Yeah. It's the best generation. And uh, it also has a million, like, high-level evolutions, so. Yeah. Right there, and Volcarona, so. And I can uh, find a Wild Dragon. You can find a wild one? Yeah, Ghost fixed it. Oh. Where are they? They also that? spawn everywhere instead. They used to spawn just the Extreme House Plus, and now they're mountainous, so... Oh. And they used to also be a midnight, so they were a higher, like, rarity, so now that they're all the time during the night, there are a lot of the There's a lot of them. What was the Extreme Thank Hills God. M, uh, Ultra Space spawn? Ultra Beast? Ultra Beast? That Stag was, uh, Stag Attacka, but you fixed it. Oh, and I also already caught one, so why the hell am I hanging around here? 
cat in this vault. Uh, Chris, did you easy. have a jolly? Uh... Um, yeah, I don't have anything I could need to catch at the moment, so let me quickly check. Um, yikes. Okay, I didn't label it jolly, but that doesn't mean I don't have one. My box is a mess when it comes to these things. I believe it. I have a modest. I have a quirky, timid. Oh, ah! Bad oh, there's, ball. A there's a wild chat ninja. I'm mad that I have one. Do you need to go modest? I are just caught one. Oh, there's two over here. Bye, Shed Ninja. Hasty. Oh, I need to buy Pokeballs. Adamant. Mana. Where are you, Mana? Hasty. Modest. Just to be clear, Mana Natural. doesn't require I think those are the same ones. Nah. Didn't I have more of these things? Ah, oh, there they are. Um, naive. Sassy. Careful. Careful. Timid. Sassy. Um, guess I don't. I need it, Timid, didn't I? Timid's down special attack? Nope. Uh -oh. You need Jolly. Rude. Uh... Yeah, it's easy to find one to sink. Yeah, thing is, find I more have a sinker. You don't have a Jolly synchronizer? No, I only... Oh. Uh, I, I have synchronizers for a few random-ass natures, and then, like, Adamant and, uh... Uh, what's it called? I mean, I can sink Modest. a sinker for you. Could okay. I mean, I I guess I'll check through my address and stuff. Luciana, where is the mana? They're not rare. Dead. Does Ultra Space get red ones? I don't think so. No. No, it's only base, uh, base game biomes. I mean, it gets the like the tigers. Oh, it gets the taiga, but, but yeah. not like actual redwoods. Unfortunate. I don't even know if it actually gets those ones because I don't think it gets like weird or biomes like that. Like I don't know if it gets all the different kinds. Of... Actually, no, I've seen Taiga M before, so it probably gets that as well. Yeah. Mana. I have a Jolly Rocks. Synchronizer. Is it or... synchronized? Do you have an ability capsule? Uh, it's not, but I do. You can buy them for a hundred grand from Eugene if needed. What? I'd rather not, but. I, I do have when did that happen? Ages and ages ago. I didn't make a big deal about it, but yeah. Eugene has connections on the black market. Oh, wait. Mana's just a moonstone, Evo? The easy. black market actually exists now. Yeah. Even though all it sells really of value is the uh, pulling machines. Although, admittedly, 50 grand does save you a lot of time gathering obsidian and crap, so... The obsidian isn't the hard part. To me, it's the emeralds. Emeralds are just annoying to play. Just kill Larvitar. Yeah. Loot Ultra like... Space. Like, Sky, every time I've said kill Larvitar, you've said no. Yeah, why would I do that? We're playing Minecraft, not Pokemon. We're playing Pixelmon, not Minecraft. No, we're playing Pokemon. With. Right. Wait. Wait. Yeah, ha 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 ha. Nice one, Minecraft idiot. Quoted, quoted, quoted. Yeah, who's gonna quote it? Exactly. Me, I edit the video out of contest. Let's go. You're just gonna stick it on. As a note, uh, in Pixelmon, the Musharna model always it's... has its eyes open. Yeah, it's terrifying. That's great. Oh well, that could have been a. I don't know. Whatever spawn in Savannah. That's that could on have been me. A... Victini. Nothing. No. Victini. No, it couldn't have. This is a day. Yes. Could have been a Raikou. No, it couldn't have. What? That was sad. <laughs> Raikou is also competing for uh, Regigigas. Oh, and Zeraora. What an awful Pokemon. 
And what? it's also Savannah's now, not specific. It's literally the worst beast dog, and it has the stupidest timing with other what things it's buying. How is it? You're harassment, guy. Okay, you cannot tell me that Raikou is better than both Entei and Suicune. Oh, Entei's the best, and Suicune's the second best, but like... Exactly. Like, Suicune is so different than Raikou and Entei, though. It's still one of the dogs, though. I like Raikou. Did anyone find that legendary, or was it on me? It was on, on you. you. Unless it was on Unless Dawn. Was Dawn. Uh, like, I'm not in that kind of biome. I love it at my house. I'm in a coniferous forest. I probably need that ghost. Oh, oh crap. Fun. Okay, I was looking in the pure birch, but I'm in one of those weird stripey biomes, so it could be It's anywhere. birch hills. Yeah. So, do you have a Rizzio? I do not, I don't think. Maybe I do. In either case, I want to find it first, then decide whether to kill it or not. But I think I ran away from it, because I thought the area I was in, which looks like Taiga, did not have it. Because it's Taiga striped with birch forest, but it's Taiga trees. I hope it did a spawn suit so I can throw a ball at it. Then I have a jolly sink. Alright, I am going to go to this flower forest and I'm going to get a petal ill. That's just going to happen. I don't know if it counts as morning right now, but we're going to go for it. I fully thought you were about to say, oh, I'm going to go to sleep. And I was just almost I uh, I would like that too. I was almost shaking yeah, at this very late at night. Cough, cough, ghost, cough, cough. Yeah, yeah ghost. I mean, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you are. I just want my petal. Hi, Scatterbug! You look just like a petal. I love it, right now. No, it's a Scatterbug, not a Spufa. Exactly. Yeah, I'm not seeing the Verizion. Eat it. Eat the grass. I think what did happen is it spawned in the Taiga bit that I didn't realize qualified, or it spawned... Yeah. Oh, there it is. Well? Did you know that Verizion is a friend of the friend of the grass? <laughs> it's a friend <laughs> of a friend. Alright. Yeah, it's a friend of the friend of the grass. Alright. Frizion is the grass. Exactly. So it's a friend of the friend that is also it. That's a circle. Yep. Alright. Especially, have you ever made a uh, circle with your voice? <laughs> All right, Sky. It's a common question. Do it right now. Ah, shit! The thing has takedown. I did. Did they die, guys? No, but I'm glad I didn't only do the third of its health before it started using takedown. I did. Sorry. I cotton. You did it. Yeah, it's just right. So, it's immune to sleep power. It's so of perfectly circle that you actually can't hear it. Oh, it went back to you before it went to your mic? Yeah. No, no, no. It it goes around the mic, but it never touches it, and it never goes in it. Oh, it's like a donut. Yeah. Nice. Nice donut voice. Thanks. <laughs> Alright. There's a koalaba, but there's no... There's a licky licky, but there's no dittos. Do you want this licky licky... Special? Do you want Vegeta? <laughs> I already have one. Did they give? I want a petal elf. Wait, did they give Licky Licky animation since last season? No, it's always had it. Oh, I just never like paid attention. Level one hundred trainer. That's cool. But there's no petal elf. Petal elf. Look inside your head. You are a pedalo. Just eat yourself. Oh. Eat your skin. I want pedalil. Oh no, that was a mistake. Oh no. 
Oh no, where did it go? Where did it uh, go? Did it jump? Uh, it used close combat and jumped, and oh. I ended up running from battle because I wanted to get it back to full health. Oh, there it is. Okay, it's over here. And that really worried me there. This mega hey, this Mega Garchomp repaid me my ability capsule. There's also a Ditto! Oh, it's my Ditto. It's so the party. Nice job. Don't mind me. Just actually stupid. What do you think its odds of surviving <laughs> a body slam are? Zero. Very high. Uh, so, False Swipe, is that that much stronger than Body Slam? Or weaker than Body Slam? Uh, it's 40 base power compared to like 80 or 90, yeah. Oh. I was trying to hope for the paralysis because I have no other way of paralyzing this thing. Do you know how about Thunder Waver? No, I actually don't. Because I've no been relying on uh, sleep powder. Bring your nuzzle Pachirisu. Probably not like a, a bad idea. A static Pokemon, like a static Pikachu. Where is the Petalil? Jesus! There's a Rotata? My eyes are peeled. Oh my god, I guess this I thought about what that means. Pain to fight. Yeah. Did you, ever, you ever thought about actually peeling your eyes? No, it's. Could you not? It means your eyelids are open. <laughs> but it is a very. Okay, you. You. No, don't want to think that. Bad Spash. Bad visual. <laughs> no, bad. Hey, you know more Yo, about spash, eyes than spash, I do. Spash, quickly, come to the Savannah. What? You need to see this. Give me 30 in-game minutes. What? Then morning will be over. Petal will stop spawning. It's not... Whatever. What's not? There's an emergency happening. And I want a Petal Yeah, I guess you don't want the shiny. I'll be there in a second! Jesus! There's an emergency happening. It is. It's emergency. Yeah, the emergency is that you're running out of IQ. Is Nuzzle priority? Huh? No, it's not at all. Oh, I guess it doesn't matter because I think the Verizian D spawned next to me. Nice. It has been a while. Wait, that's my lobby, not my Charizard. Unless it jumped somewhere? Wee, 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 wee. It may have despawned on me. I didn't even get to kill it. I shiny. arrived. Look at this crazy shiny. I hate Pokemon that can kill themselves. This makes them so much what? harder to catch. See, it spawned in the uh, extreme. Please don't. Ghost, can you ban Spesh from the server? He just killed the Ditto in front of me. <laughs> You know what? Just because of that, I'm killing this herdier. Damn me, wait, no! There's actually a herdier! No, I want that! No! How's it feel? How's it feel, Spesh? Why did you kill that? <laughs> Alright, well, I think it's a good time to end because my legendary is gone, everything you guys loved was gone. Guys, so. you didn't expect me to! Why would you do? Why would you do? <coughs> Sky, why did you make me come here for a ditto and expect me not to kill it? Because you're not stupid. Is that why it's dead? Yes, because you're stupid and decided to kill it. <laughs> so I killed what you were looking for for half the episode. I'm so mad that there was a herdier there you didn't tell me. Right, well. I, I literally noticed it when I turned around. Because you killed <laughs> you it. That was, it, on the it was spot. karma. It was karma in action. My face hurts. <laughs> Alright, well, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode of Pixelmon. Leave a like if you did, subscribe for more, hit that notification bell, and we'll see you next time. Goodbye.